So, Huawei recently launched its high silicon Kirin 9000 chipset, which is likely the last flagship mobile processor from the company for the time being, as it is restricted by the United States from using American technology or components. The company had launched the Huawei P40 series smartphones, powered by the Kirin 990 SoC, which was expected to be the last flagship offering from the company on its own Kirin lineup of processors. However, that may not be the case, according to the recent leaks, it looks quite different. But before further we do, if you do end up liking what you see here, please consider subscribing and turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon. Now let's get back to the video. So, as per the latest information coming from China, Huawei executive has revealed that the company has reserved a significant portion of the Kirin 9000 SoC for future smartphones, including the likes of the P50 series and even the Mate 50 series that could launch this year. It is also being reported that the upcoming Huawei P50 series smartphones will be equipped with the Kirin 9000 and Kirin 9000 e chipsets. The standard variant will have a display with a 90Hz refresh rate, while the high-end model will feature a 120Hz screen. So, Huawei's flagship smartphones are known for their camera performance, and that is expected to continue with future devices, as the company hasn't stopped the research and development for the P-Series and Mate Series phones. The smartphones in the series are expected to have 66 watts of fast charging and 50 watts of wireless charging, while the top-end variant could end up supporting 135 watts of charging if the battery density and durability test passes successfully. Interestingly, it is not expected to be running Harmony OS and will have an Android-based EMUI 11 operating system. To maintain the image quality that Huawei phones are well known for, the company will continue to use the Leica lens. The upcoming P50 lineup is expected to camera setup similar to the Mate 40 lineup but with increased zoom capabilities. So, what do you guys think about the upcoming Huawei P50 series, let me know in the comments down below, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video.